Hey everybody, welcome back to Dunrovin Ranch in lovely Lola, Montana. I am your air-conditioned ranch manager, Kelly. I'm currently in the ranch office, and I'm going to give you a little intro um, to the video you're going to see, and then I'm gonna head outside um, to the ranch and uh, talk to y'all a little bit about uh, Ranch Hen Wardasani. Um, full disclosure, we had a little technical difficulty, and believe it or not, James the Masta is on the phone with me all the way from Germany. Um, good luck getting away. You know, Dunrovin's like the mafia. You try to get away and we pull you back in. So without further ado, you, know, you all know Ranch Hen Wardasani. And um, Montana Wild in Helena, Montana, was gracious enough to loan us a mounted um, osprey that uh, Ranch Hen Wardasani could use in her classroom for our awesome osprey project. And she also took it to Auberge Assisted Living, I believe, and uh, they got to see the taxidermied, I learned that's a word, osprey. He does not, he or she does not have a name, and I think that's we should remedy that. Let's have another another go at it in the chat room. So without further ado, I'm going to um, uh, play the video for you, and then I'm going to pop back on and um, talk to you a little bit more. So without further ado, Kelly said again as she's looking at her instructions. Here we go. home today. Let's go get some coffee. Here we are at Waterwork Hill this morning, Monday, June 10th. We're about to embark on a hike with our friends Katie and the Osprey. All right, here we go. my Osprey and I are climbing up Waterworks Hill this morning. We hear quite the fantastic, beautiful sounds. We have reached our destination at the Montana Wild Education and Wildlife Centers with our friend, the Osprey. It's been a nice ride. We hate to see you go, but it's been fun. That was awesome. Um, she's hilarious, obviously, and I wish you all could have spent the two summers and some late springs with her like all of us have because she was truly a joy to have around. And um, last night was her last shift, and I know she gave you a lovely send off with the heart, and we had big hugs. Um, but the good news is, is that she's not out of our lives, of course, forever. And I, I think she's getting a new puppy, and I am now Aunt Kelly, and I will be able to do puppy sitting. And when I do, of course, I will introduce the puppy on camera. And so we have to come up with a name. I think the name's gonna be Sadie Mae, if I haven't spoiled any secrets. And Sadie Mae will be a Springer Spaniel, 
and we'll bring her here and Arrow is awesome with puppies and that should be a blast. So I'm going to actually mute my mic everyone and head on out and uh, talk to you out there. I'm going to mute my mic so you don't have to listen to doors and um, gate latches. So I will be back in a second. Hi everyone, I'm back and I forgot to give you the weather um, today. It's hot. It's probably 90. Um, we have a river ride going out. Uh, Rosemary's taking uh, the father and son who are here from Spain and staying here with us for a week. And then we have Arlene and Stephanie. Where are y'all visiting from? North Carolina. North Carolina. Uh-oh. Anywhere near Lenore? I am. You're Come here. Oh. This is Arlene. She's where you from? The reason I say this is one of our members who's probably watching is camera operates from Lenore. Oh, wow. Well, I say Lenore. Actually, it's sort of between where the two of us live. I live in the Asheville area. Okay. A little town called Hendersonville. And Lenore is a little more to the east, northeast mountains where Boone and Blowing Rock are. Okay. And Stephanie lives in Winston-Salem. Oh my gosh, I'm sure they all, she knows that a lot. Well, I bet, she I bet she's jealous. Aww. Who are you riding today? I'm riding Garnet. Beautiful. Isn't he gorgeous? Animal, he's so sweet. Oh. You all have so, fun. I'm excited. Thank you. Thank you. Isn't that fun? <laughs> so let me talk a little bit about Ranch and Mortisani. We met um, a year and a half ago, I think. She spent two summers with us, so that makes sense. So she had um, contacted me over the winter um, asking to work here. And she had zero experience and it was the middle of winter and I didn't contact her back. And I thought that was the end of it. But no, she booked a ride with us later. And I said, oh, this is the woman who wanted to be um, a ranch hand here. And she came into the office, we took the ride and she came into the office, I think she rode whiskey. And she said, I want to be a ranch hand. And I said, yeah, I know, you know, I appreciate your interest, but you have zero experience. And she said, I can do it. I want to do it. I have to do it. I said, yeah, I know, I, I, you know, thanks a lot, but no. And she said, I'm not leaving your office until you hire me. And you know, there's something about that statement that makes you believe in people. And so I hired her. We hired her. And as you know, she has been, it sounds like she's passed away. She hasn't. She has been such an asset to the ranch in a number of ways. She is incredibly diligent uh, in what she does. She is hilarious. She's very positive and very optimistic. Um, cares about the animals uh, a lot, cares about the property a lot, um, was always texts me with uh, questions and comments, um, even when I would be cranky because I did, because <laughs> it was a day off. I hope she's watching. Um, but she did anyway, um, just to let me know what was going on at the ranch. She is a master list maker. I wish I had kept the lists that she left for me or other members of the staff because they were um, very involved and, hmm, what can I say? She's very organized. And her handwriting is that lovely teacher writing, um, the, her printing, excuse me, is very teacher printing. Um, large letters, easy to read. The only thing missing were um, 
circles or hearts above, <laughs> above the eyes, but she may have, um, and, I, and I just missed it. She, what else can I say about Katie? Mm. Oh, great at cleaning the rooms. Obviously, you know, when, you, when I, attention to detail um, is very much a part of who she is. Um, as you also know, she was involved, uh, very involved uh, in days at Dunrovin. She was, she really kept the awesome Osprey project going. She was a spectacular teacher and she, with the awesome Osprey project and other subjects, she, I know that she took her students uh, to Auberge, formerly Brookdale, and spent some time with the residents there um, with the students, which meant a lot to everybody. She, what can I say about Katie? Oh, after she moved here, of course, after she got the job, she had to get a truck. So she did get a truck, and we had our first interview with her in the arena, in the back of her truck, with coolers and lawn chairs. And I think that we will um, revisit that set um, very soon, and uh, we will do a, a, a follow-up with Katie on what she's done since she's left the ranch. She also got custom license plates, and that was a thing back and forth. What do, what do we do? And she settled on R. H. Ward, Ranch Hand Ward Asani. Um, she was in charge of uh, when we had our, our days at Dunrovin meetings. She was in charge of keeping the calendar updated. Um, keeping us all together, making sure that she checked off what was done and she would send reminders um, for what wasn't done. Uh, her, you know, she was RHW here. Um, we would text each other RHW, Kelly, you know, she would call me boss. Um, I didn't ask for it, but it felt pretty good <laughs> to be called boss, whether or not she really felt that way, I don't know. But she was RHW um, to me. For days at Dunrovin in the Awesome Osprey Project, she was ARB. Um, I, I don't know if I should say what that is. ARB. I don't think I will. I think I will save that. And um, RHW, RHW can share with you what uh, ARB means if she'd like to. Um, Katie, I recommend keeping it a secret and let them guess. They'll never guess. She has gone on to work in a different school district, and I know we're no, it hasn't quite been settled what grade she'll teach or whether she'll teach um, other things, but uh, that's in talks right now. Um, she has, let's go back to the truck. She has hay stuck in the corners of her truck now. I saw inside yesterday there's dirt. You know, where you're sitting in your vehicle and there's the brake pedal and the gas pedal and the clutch, hopefully, if you can drive a manual. Carpet, and then there's that little crease right here next to the door, full of dirt and gravel. That's how you know she's truly ranch hand Wardasani. What else has she, what else have we done with Wardasani? We've had a lot of fun things. Her salutes are epic, uh, as you know. Um, she can twirl things. She actually is quite the um, musician. We may have to uh, rope her in, maybe over the winter when, um, when I'm not quite as uh, visible or we're not, not quite as much going on, maybe she'll come out and uh, we'll play some music because um, I, won't even re I won't reveal James' secret, but the two of them could probably produce a little entertainment for you. So what else? What else? Oh, the, the epic, the epic hot summer water tub salute um, will really go down in history, I think, as one of the more ridiculous things uh, that we've done here. Maybe James, maybe we need a reel. Maybe we need a salute reel. A reel is um, a compilation of, of short videos, kind of like a montage. Whiskey is her favorite horse. Um, he's a lot of people's favorite horse. And so um, I think we will try 
I will try to get RHW here and we will take a final trail ride. You know, maybe we should cross the river. She can ride whiskey and we'll head on over for some fun. Um, she dumped carts, manure carts, when it was hot and she didn't want to. Although here's a little secret. Last night was her last night and she texted Lila for permission. She paid Lila five bucks to dump those <laughs> so she could leave the last cart full. Have fun. Who are you on, Butte? Don't you love Butte? How? It's okay, baby. Have fun, everybody. There's whiskey. I'm so proud of you, man. You feel okay now? Dugan, Seferino on Rocket. You look like you know what you're doing. Thank you very much. Yeah. <laughs> Arlene. Bye. Bye, have fun. Thank you so much. Okay. And there they go across the river. What else can I say about RHW? Hmm. You know, the attention to detail. The woman can muck. The woman can muck. She can do everything. She really can do everything. And oh, we have kind of a, a thing. Um, I coined the term ranch fit to describe people who do not have to go to the gym. And um, I had some hats made and Katie has one and she wore it often. Um, it was pink and gray, it said ranch fit across the front. And I think, I, I think she only wore it, though, if she was wearing something else with pink in it. So she matched, which I appreciate. We're both big matchers. And when she started up this season, she said, well, boss, I'm not ranch fit. I'm, I'm going to get ranch fit. And darn it, I believe she is. So any of you out there who are so fit, you don't need to go to the gym, I'll hook you up with a hat. We are going to miss her around here. I could, she was... Uh, infinitely reliable. I didn't have to check in. I didn't have to look at the cams. I knew that um, whether I needed to know it or not, I would know uh, what was happening out here. And I say that with full affection. And I love knowing everything that goes on out here. It's, been, uh, it's hard not to. It's hard not to turn on the cameras and make sure. But uh, we have incredible staff. Um, and she passed the baton well. Hmm, what can I tell you? Hopefully, she, maybe, oh, you know, she's quite the cook also. Um, hopefully, she'll come back and pick some apples and make, make us some apple pie. I bet she's watching. I don't know if she's on the chat. I don't have anyone talking into my ear, so um, I don't know, but I hope she's on the chat. Her video was classic. Um, she's just great. She's going to be hugely missed. Um, we all love her very much. And... She will be back, if not to work. Um, maybe she'll come back for a surprise salute, or maybe she'll introduce her, her puppy herself. Um, but Katie Wardasani, um, it's a, you know, that if, I wrote a, if I wrote a book about it, that she would be a, a central character. Um, she's, she, it was very emotional for her to leave this because she has said that this was a huge part of her life. And it was definitely a bucket list. She wanted to work on a ranch. And boy, she made it happen. And she did a great job. Um, it's almost like the perfect person kind of dropped into the ranch's lap and busted it out and completed, com did what she had to do and moved on, although she just lives a couple blocks away. So she's not far, far gone. I can't, I, I don't know what more to say about her. She's just um, bubbly. Katie, you're bubbly. I feel like this is the Oscars and this is a retrospective. Um, just a positive person um, and fast moving, fast moving, fast talking. Um, you probably don't know that because she's been on the chat, but boy, does she talk fast and boy, does she move fast. I don't think she cannot do anything in a hurry. Um, that's one of the things I, I know most about her. It's like, boss, da 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 I'm like, all right, thanks. <laughs> Take care of it. Good job. 
Ranch Hen Wotasani um, will be missed. Um, I know you all enjoyed her as much as we did down here, and you know she's still going to be on the chat. There's no way she can not be on the chat. And I'm sure she'll send pics and uh, continue to text me um, if something needs doing or something seems amiss. And uh, I hope you enjoyed her little film. She's a nut job, and that's why she fit in so well here. Um, I hope you continue. I hope you're able to watch the river ride, and that is our only ride of the day. And I'll pop back out um, probably 4.30 or so and help with the PM chores. And then, oh, tonight is Mac at 6.30. That's right, Mac's here at 6.30 with, with a canner. And I'm going to bid you goodbye. I hope it's cooler where you are. Then, oh, the, the clouds. That's nice. Anyway, thanks for hanging with me today. Um, and we will see you tonight at 6.30. Bye.